Today's PC is a collection of hardware, an operating system, and applications. The hardware has specific components like USB host controllers, an audio system, and graphics cards that require specific drivers loaded and managed in the operating system. The operating system abstracts the function of these components through the console session and exposes native interfaces to the applications loaded on the PC. This system ensures fantastic performance, but at the cost of having all the hardware resources tied up in one desktop, with less than 20% utilization at best, and a whole collection of drivers and OS updates that must be updated throughout its life cycle at significant cost and complexity. Virtual Desktop Infrastructure, or VDI, is a new way to deploy desktops that uses the power and flexibility of server virtualization to allow many desktops to share the hardware resources and automate the deployment of desktops by treating them as files that can be cloned, copied, backed up, destroyed, and provisioned at the press of a button. However, most VDI technologies use the existing terminal services technology and the remote desktop protocol to link a user in front of a FinCline or PC back to the server room. The terminal services session does not have full access to the console session or the native Windows interfaces, resulting in a degradation of performance. Further, since the client software necessary to parse RDP is an application itself, it must be deployed on top of its own operating system with interfaces to drivers and hardware that must be managed over its lifecycle. The Pano Virtual Desktop solution with Console Direct Technology delivers the best of VDI while delivering a PC-like experience. The Pano Desktop service is installed into the template of a virtual desktop and provides a connection to the native interfaces of the console session. This improves the user experience by enabling smooth scrolling, resizing, tight audio-video synchronization, and other improvements not capable in RDP-based implementations. But it also enables USB devices plugged into the Pano device to have direct access to the console session using the native drivers installed in the virtual desktop. This enables interactive devices like touchscreens, smart boards, to just work with no hassles. And since the Pano device is a zero client, there is no software to manage your configurations to set. Now let's see a quick demonstration of how Pano VDS 2.5 with Console Direct improves a common application like Internet Video. Hello, Chicago! If there is anyone out there who still doubts that America is a place where all things are possible, who still wonders if the dream of our founders is alive in our time, who still questions the power of our democracy. Tonight is your answer. Hello, Chicago. If there is anyone out there who still doubts that America is a place where all things are possible, who still wonders if the dream of our founders is alive in our time, who still questions the power of our democracy, tonight 
is your answer.